Thanks for sticking with us on 10 Tampa Bay. And right now, we are still tracking Tropical Storm Idalia. And with tropical systems, your location does matter when it comes to what kind of impacts you'll see from the storm and what kind of damage you can expect. Now, you may hear our meteorologist say something about the dirty side of the storm. So what is that and why is it different? Meteorologist Natalie Ferrari explains. The dirty side of a storm refers to the area of a hurricane or tropical system where you'll find the highest winds, highest storm surge, and the greatest tornado threat. So what side of the storm is that? Well, generally, it's the northeast side of the storm, or more simply put, the right side of the storm. But it also depends on which direction the storm is moving. If it's traveling in a northern direction, the dirty side will be more on the direct right hand or eastern side. If the storm is traveling in a more western direction, the dirty side will be more more on top of it, or the northern side. So what makes it so dirty? It's all about the wind direction and a little math. For example, if a storm is moving north at 30 miles per hour and has wind speeds of 100 miles per hour, then the storm will produce winds of 130 miles per hour on the right dirty side of the storm, while on the left side, winds move in the opposite direction of the storm's movement, so they'll be slower at 70 miles per hour. It's important to remember, though, as a storm grows stronger, every side becomes dangerous. And right now on our 10 Tampa Bay YouTube page, you can find more of our hurricane hacks with everything you need to prepare yourself, your family, and your home in case of a storm. 